There are two towers in the palace defense network. Restore them, and I will open the way to the palace. Gotcha, Chala. Oh, yeah, there it is. I knew there was something at the very beginning of this. There always is. And there's Dazi on Justice. Oh, you didn't get earlier is a mystery of me, but uh, who cares? It's, uh, at least it's a collectible now. Better later than, later than never, right? That's how I always think. Yeah! Yeah, we got one more little tower defense mission. We gotta get two more of those networks. Uh, up and running. In order to make sure that we can get, you know, possessed and all that great stuff. So let's get some work on this. And now we get these guys coming out of the water for Ever some reason. And I think probably enough. Oh, yeah. They come out of the water and you can throw them back into the water to kill them. I guess they just didn't have much uh, lungs when they came out. Or something. Who knows. It's a very, very odd detail. They start picking up on pretty quickly. Okay, yeah, let's go. Focus! Oh, I just barely missed him. No, you can't I could have gotten the extra bonus thing. That. Oh, and there's another one. I'll worry about that in a second. Might get rid of this cross I'm gonna die. There we go. Much better. And get rid of you. And uh, you. And then finally, a you. You know, I'm getting pretty good at this. Oh, of course, that's gonna knock me out. But screw you, boy. Get the laser. There's a face. It needs a lot of money, There we go. Oh, Savannah! There are three more! And now we get uh, these guys. Another little publication potty thingy. Wait, what am I doing? I don't need to fight you right now. I can just go up here. Oh, and there, sure enough, that was yay. More importantly for me, I'm gonna do what I do best. And I'm gonna clear! Here goes nothing! Jing! Shaw! That's never, and I mean, never gets old. I'll tell you one thing that does get old, fighting these guys. Oh, now I get the purple enemies. Which I do not remember what they do, I believe they just teleport and nothing but. Making them a little akin to Deadpool. But that doesn't really mean much in the grand scheme of things, so, uh, yeah, bigger poison. You must still restore the power core to the defense tower. I know that! I'm in the middle of a fight! You know this too because you're fighting with us! Be patient, woman! Okay, see? Now we'll do it! Okay? Okay! Okay! We're good! Let's go! Who wants a little pot? How about? I've been doing that since before we were born. Oh, and another one is showing up to, uh, take his spot and annoying us. Oh, it's so grandiose like. But you will have to wait, my friend, while I beat up that little fire freak. And this other fire freak. Just be patient, my little lovey, lovey. You'll get your chance in the spotlight soon enough. And did you pop over there? No? Okay. It must have been uh, much up here. Yep, there it is. And there he is! Again! I am not see a trend here. Are there just a bunch of fire super villains in the Marvel Universe that I'm unaware of? You know, I'm really or does a freaking Nanite Serum also be come with, you know, a Nanite... Uh, Nanite? A, a Nanite fusion kind of mixture. Where just gives him an extra bonus superpower because why the heck not? I don't know, it's just an odd thing that I like to think of. Oh no, wait, hold on. Then again, he did fight Bold Man earlier, so assuming he is, you know, either A still alive or B uh, still linked to the nanites, which I don't see how he wouldn't be. 
that weren't the case. Um, maybe he's channeling through these guys at random? For some odd reason? Who knows? Who knows? Anything else? Ah, uh, yep. The Asgardian Rune. And funnily enough, this is where I actually unlocked Thor the first time around. Yep, very late game. I, and I equipped him straight away, making my ultimate Avengers team. And man, was I fangasming so hard. We got freaking Avengers, man. They were as classic as you can get. More classic to me than the freaking Justice League. And that's saying something. Okie dokie. Hardy chokey. So we just gotta grab on. And then go on up. It appears we are safe, thanks to you. But it seems things are going badly back in New York. I will patch you in. Priority one distress call from Stark Tower to all friendly forces. <laughs> we are under attack. Invading forces comprised of nanite controlled criminals as well as infected superheroes, including oh! Yeah, things are not going well back at Stark Tower, as you can tell. We better get inside. I will continue trying to contact our allies. Panther calling Stark Tower. She-Hulk, do you re Fury? Is that you? It ain't your Aunt May, kid. Though I might just be the only guy left who's still got a few years on the old girl. Leave her out of this, Fury. Or whatever you are. Well, that only leaves MJ to pick on then. Or maybe she's already in the fold by now. You gotta wonder. Oh. What are you talking about? Come on, Pete. You're smarter than that. We're the future. And you know it. For millions of years, single-cell organisms were as good as it got on Earth. Stupid little owners barely scraping by. Then they started joining together, eventually turning into you and me. And now it's time for our minds to join up? Is that it? Natural progression, kid. Cooperate or die. Instead of seven billion solo brains fighting each other all the time, we're gonna get one huge brain with seven billion cells. It's gonna be incredible. Okay, you must have me confused with Ant-Man Fury. I'm not into that whole group mind thing. Oh, you will be. Very soon. Hmm. In that case, uh, can we at least change the name to something cooler? I mean, come on. The Fold. <laughs> you guys must suck at poker. Joke all you want, kid. It'll all make sense to you once you're one of us. We'll see about that. But man, I've never gotten that exchange before, and I'm glad I decided to pick Spider-Man for that. Uh, now if only I could see what Deadpool's reaction would be. Actually... Maybe I'll do that in the post uh slate for this episode. Maybe. Assuming I remember. But yeah, now we got full invasion! You would think that they were, you know, impervious to this, but no, they somehow gotten in. And now we gotta defend the freaking palace itself. And it's you know pretty straightforward. That being said, time to Ah. Goblin. Really? I knew you'd be coming in, but this soon? Okay then. If you like making my life a little bit more miserable, then fine. You can waste my future star. Just know you can get your foot kicks when I'm done with you. But yeah, guess who's back? Goblin boy. And this time around, he also got firepower, just like everyone else. So it ain't that very special. Alright then. Yeah, let's get rid of him. As well as that fire guy. Yep, come on. Excuse me. You need to chill out, friend. Oh, really? I'm not a big fan of cold blood, boys. Ah, the bombs. Okay, ow. Okay, you Break it! Get lasered, boy! Just get freaking lasered. And you die. Oh man, that was 
little uh, aggravating. I'll take a fire guy over the, uh, the ice guy. Looks like it might be nap time for Spidey. Oh, calm down, Peter. You'll be fine. You survived much worse in this game. I guarantee it. You might know it. You might not know it directly, but uh, yeah. Oh, wait, where's Goblin? Where is Goblin? Come on, Goblin, buddy. Ow, ow. Okay, we need to do this again. Let's do it. Laser beam. Laser! Okay, grab it, okay, grab it, okay, grab it. Perfect! Yep, and now Venom's back. But don't worry, there's nothing more to it. Now, we do this good old straight boss by style. But here's a little interesting gimmick. Whatever little pull Venom's hanging on to, you whack it. Because, if you remember the comics, Venom is very weak to actual sounds. And an interesting thing is if you keep whacking it while he's next to it, you can do a lot of damage to him. He will not be going anywhere as long as you hit that, that little uh, pull thing. So, uh, wards of the wise, keep hitting that pull. It does wonders. If they don't have the good sense to stay down, we will put them down once again. Where's the last one? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? I guess it's a good thing there's only two of these. Well, let's end this. You know, I'm getting pretty good at this. So let's end this. Get them both! There's the Venom. And all that's left is Osborne. Stick around. I Let's put an this, shall we? Shall I do this the old fashioned way? Once more. And stay down. I think our work here is done. Defeat the full invaders. Yes. Oh, and defeat Green Goblin, no revival. Awesome! Thank you. Without your aid, I shudder to think what would have become of my homeland. Now, what should we do with these two? Funny you should mention that, T'Challa. Because I've got a very good idea. The fall of Stark Tower was just the beginning. Over the past few weeks, the Fold has aggressively ramped up its campaign to take over all of humanity. Many of our closest friends and allies remain unaccounted for. We have to assume they've been taken into the Fold. It's no coincidence either. The Fold's primary targets are clearly superhumans. And thanks to the acquisition of Fury and his decades of intel, they've been able to make serious inroads in expanding the Collective's power base. Fortunately, Fury's knowledge of Wakanda isn't comprehensive, which is why we've been using Black Panther's palace as our temporary base of operations. Fold forces were unable to retrieve Venom and Green Goblin after you defeated them. Using the pure nanite samples your team obtained from Prison 42, we've been able to cure these two criminals of their infection. Venom and Goblin both claim a strong desire to help us stop the Fold. They're not the most trustworthy of allies, but frankly, we can't afford to turn them away. With the Fold growing exponentially, infecting entire populations at a time, it's becoming obvious we can't win a war of attrition against them. Their network seems to be the key. If we could only find a way to disrupt it. Unfortunately, they've clearly been taking steps to make that all but impossible. Our best minds are working hard to devise a strategy to defeat the Fold before it becomes unstoppable. We'll let you know if and when we come up with anything solid. My home is yours, friends. Everything here is at your disposal. Let us meet at the briefing station when you are ready to act. So yeah, just like that. Venom and the Green Goblin are now unlockable, playable characters in the team. You were probably wondering who they were, and there you go. You can play as the Green Goblin and the last of the big brutes, Venom. And don't worry, friends, I'll be showing them off uh, pretty soon. Next session, actually. Because, well... I don't see why not. And, you know, that being said, guys... Well... Eh, you know what? I, I don't think I will. I don't want to, you know... I don't want to be too spoilery right about now. But uh, I will say this much. We are getting near the endgame. We have come such a long way in Marvel Ultimate Alliance 2. 
we have gone from a, you know, freaking nuclear assault, whatever you want to call it, back in uh, Latveria, a uh, one year ago from this game's story events, and maybe, maybe a few months after uh, that specific jump in history, you know, however you look at it, we have spent basically two whole uh, in-game years on this, and it's pretty interesting to see, you know, how this is all unfolded. From the Latveria attack to where we are now. And also, I'm, like I said this before, but I'm very curious if this whole nanite agency control thing was implemented into the Civil War movie. Because if so, well, I'm very, tr I'm very interested. Now, I haven't seen the movie, so I wouldn't know as of this point in time. So, there you go. But yeah, Endgame is near. Next session... I don't know what's going to happen with that, we'll see where that goes, but either way guys, that's going to do it for this session of Marvel Ultimate Alliance 2. If you guys did enjoy, of course, as always, make sure to leave a like and comment down below, share this video with your friends, should you feel the need to, and of course, if you are new here to the channel and want to see more Marvel Ultimate Alliance 2 as it comes out daily, along with other series I decide to throw into the mixer. And make sure you have subscribed and join the Drenites and our team here in Wakanda, in Wakanda to see what we do next. What is our next uh, plan in stopping the fold? Only time will tell. But hey, until next time, this is my Angel Force signing out. Have a great rest of your day. Take care, and I hope to see you guys tomorrow with some more. Marvel Ultimate Alliance 2. The final power core must still be placed in the large tower. It's about time. I love this arm. Don't you? Panther calling Stark Tower. She Hulk, do you read? Yuri, is that you? It's me in a way, and so much more. Hmm, <laughs> you don't look like you put on much weight. Oh, I put on a lot, tons. But you're gonna have to join the fold as well to really understand what I'm talking about. The fold? Hundreds of brains working together and that's the best name you could come up with? Joke all you want, kid. It'll all make sense to you once you're one of us. I mean, what about the Cabal? Hmm, no, too French. What about the Phalanx? No, wait, taken. Hilarious. So, you're not willing to join us even if I said I'd call out the attack on Stark Tower? Come on, even I know the game doesn't end with us just agreeing to join you, bozos. Your pointless quips will be over once you're in the fold.